Hello everybody, this is Tim from Mainly Muscle Cars along with cameraman Ken and today we're looking at a 1976 Bronco. A uh, really neat little Bronco, um, as everybody knows we're looking at Bronco 76s were one, among the best optioned ones. Typically power steering, power disc brakes, automatic, this has all those, um, all work nice. It's currently showing 76,000 miles on the odometer. Most of the time I would say, oh, you know, plan on it being a lot more. This one actually I kind of believe and kind of going everything, it very well kind of gives you indication that it is. I have no documentation to prove it, um, so it's basically, that's the number on the odometer, that's what we're going by. Um, real neat rig, it's uh, single repaint in the Rangoon Red. It's got a brand new black interior in it now. Now, originally it had uh, the orange style interior with a comfort weave. However, trying to get a replacement for that is uh, next to impossible and it's not, in my opinion, the best looking interior. Um, so, brand new black interior though, black carpet, black door panels, rear panels, all in good shape. Uh, really neat little truck. Uh, as you can see, it's got uh, BF Goodrich radial all terrain, actually mud terrains on it. Um, those are 33 1250s. It's got a matching spare wheel. This the spare tire is slightly smaller. Um, we'll get you out in a jam, uh, but that way it doesn't break out that rear quarter panel. It's a good solid truck though. Uh, walking around the outside, I don't see any signs of rust or anything like that. Um, it does have uh, front floor pans that were put in it, uh, but overall a good solid truck. Steering feels real nice and tight. Like I said, it does actually drive like a 76,000 mile truck. Now we went through, we replaced all the marker lights and the bezels and stuff like that. Uh, touched up the paint on the grill. It has the nice new Ford emblems in the front. Uh, bumpers are new. Um, just a really good, clean truck. We'll go ahead and jump in and take it for a drive. Okay, on the inside here, it's uh, we've got a new headliner in this one. It's in good shape. Uh, like I said new uh, carpet front to back, new seat upholstery on the front seats and that back seat. Um, just a good clean interior. Dash has that uh, a new cap on it. Now there are some small scratches on the dash, and those can be touched up pretty easy to do. Which haven't got to it yet. But uh, a real nice running truck. Uh, it has that remote mirror too, which actually is a real hard unit to find. But actually, I drove this for about a week. Um, it's been actually pretty chilly out here, probably in the uh, you know in the 20s and teens at night. Uh, fortunately, my garage is full of uh, muscle cars, so it gets I was sitting outside the, the garage in the driveway. Uh, however, on a cold morning, you can fire this thing right up, and I'd walk inside. Ten minutes later, I'd come back. All the windows were defrosted. It was nice and toasty, and then I'd drive on. And really neat to actually find a car that. You know, a classic that you can get in that behaves like a late model. You know, granted, it's not going to start as easy as a brand new car, but uh, typically hit the gas one time, fire it up, and you know, at, at 15, 20 degrees, kind of sputters a little bit. And then you, then you fire it right back up with one pump, and it goes right up to a nice fast idle. Real reliable that way. The heater works nice. You know, all the speeds on it. The cables have all been cleaned. Um, so, real nice little truck. But it's a nice quiet cruiser. It's got insulation underneath the carpet. It's got that nice thick jute. Um, so it's quiet. You can drive this thing on the highway. Uh, just a very, very comfortable, very comfortable truck. Not a lot of wind noise. Uh, that's kind of one of the indications I think this thing hasn't really been used that hard. It has low miles, so. Uh, but power disc brakes, they work excellent. That automatic shifts really nice. Uh, 302 is bone stock underneath the hood there. Uh, it does have dual exhaust now. I guess that would be the one upgrade it has. But it still has this factory exhaust manifold, the factory air cleaner, and it has that uh, the fresh air intake with the factory hose that runs to the front. So you have that, you have the hot air intake, so when it's cold, it basically pulls that air off that exhaust manifold just like it was designed to, lets it warm up faster. Uh, Power-wise, these things were, you know, were rated fairly low. But, uh, you know, still good torquey 302, but the downshift's fine. Anyway, with three, and with three five gears, it's nice and comfortable. It has good power. It definitely will get out of its own way. Uh, but you can still cruise on the highway, you know, 70 miles an hour. This is a comfortable vehicle. But we 
actually have about seven Broncos in right now. Uh, this is real nice, everyday driver style Bronco. Uh, has that perfect lift, nice stance. I want to say it's a two and a half inch lift on this one uh, from Wild Horses. So just a real good streetable lift. Uh, but we have them from stock all the way up to uh, one of 37 inch tires and a 418. So this one though, as far as in the driver realm is great. If you have any questions, give us a call. Our number is 360-863-2241. Or you can visit us on our website at mainlymusclecars.com. If there's something that you're looking for and you don't see it on our website, please give us a call. Uh, typically only about half of our vehicles are on the website just due to you know different vehicles getting done. And oftentimes people call in and buy vehicles before they make it to the website. So look forward to hearing from you. Thanks.